In this tip, I'm giving you a very simple drill to teach you how to hit your irons pure. So who hits pure iron shots? Pros. <laughs> so what we wanna do is we wanna be in a very similar, if not the same position when we're hitting our irons as pros. So what does a pro look like when they're hitting an iron? Well, you're gonna be able to see this cheek right here and the great majority have this heel off the ground at impact. And I know there's a few pros working on keeping this foot flat. I don't know why they're doing that. I would never teach that and never tell anybody to do that. I want the heel off the ground three to four inches with irons, five to six inches with woods or driver as you're hitting the ball. That's because you're driving the lower body even harder with longer clubs. So three, four inches right here with irons at impact. If you get that, you'll start to hit pure irons. All right, so typically average players are not in that position at impact. This is why they don't hit their irons pure. So basically your average person is gonna take it to the top. They're gonna try and hit the ball with their arms and they just basically face the ball when they hit the ball. That means their hips are even with the ball and they're flat footed on this back shoe. Don't believe me? Just video your swing and see if you are doing that. I am telling you this is 80, 90% of everybody I've taught, you know, over many, many years. So this is a big problem and that's why, you know, your average player doesn't hit pure irons. So we want to get the weight off of that foot. So here's the drill. We're going to tee up our ball. I'd like you to do some practice swings first. So we're doing our setup position like this. We're going to go to the top. We're not lifting here. Okay. We're not lifting here. That's too soon. We're going to start our rotation into our downswing. Club will get parallel to the ground. Now from here to the ball, that's when we're going to lift it. Now keep in mind, I am not lifting my heel on purpose. I'm turning, which pulls my heel off the ground as I hit the ball. I'm turning, that pulls my heel off the ground. But I know your average uh, player doesn't have enough hip rotation. So this is just another way to get us off of this back foot through impact. All right, so we're gonna hit the top. We do our nice setup, okay? We go up to the top right here we're coming down just before we get to the ball we're going to lift all right so here we're coming in lift just as we're going to hit the ball if the heel is lifting your weight is shifting so too many people you know they hang back they scoop okay stuff like this okay we got to get you off of that foot so we're into the forward foot through impact and that's what's gonna get us to hit pure irons. So do a few practice swings like that, and then I would start off very slow and easy. Right here, like super slow. Okay, that was all of 50 yards right there. Okay, so you get into the feeling of it. It's a little different. You're not good at it, you're not used to it. So you wanna kinda slowly build it up. Don't sit here and go, you know, a million miles an hour right out of the gate. This is new, it's different. Your weight's gonna be over here as you come through impact into the forward leg. If you're used to hanging back like this, this could create a little balance issue if you went super fast at it. Okay, so another thing you should probably do as you do the drill, take your phone, put it right here, or have your friend video you and then freeze it at impact. See if your heel is off the ground as you hit that ball. All right, if it's not, then you need to lift it a little sooner. But again, we're not here lifting, okay? We're rotating and we're going to lift it right here. When the club is parallel to the ground, that's when we're gonna lift it, all right? So nice and easy, then of course you go a little faster. Okay, that's not full out. That's about 130 yards right there. Okay, so you keep doing it until you get better and better at it. Okay, it's technique. 
you know, a lot of people think they're going to get this stuff in like two seconds. It's like this is a little bit of a different move for you. It's getting you in more of an impact position of a pro. So this is going to take a little bit of work. But the payoff is you will finally learn how to hit pure irons. Wouldn't that be great if you could just hit, get that nice compressed sound, get the perfect trajectory, hit the ball on target all the time? Yeah. So for the sake of doing a little drill, you know, pretty regularly until you get the feel for it, the payoff is huge in the future. So from here, we go into our real swing now and you'll see that my heel is off the ground as I hit the ball. Do the drill, you'll get your heel off too, and then you'll start hitting pure irons. I truly hope you've enjoyed this tip. Here's another tip that's going to help you improve your swing. Now right below that, don't forget to click on that link because I'm going to send you some free samples of my body swing book and video series that'll take you step by step by step through how to build a powerful, effortless, pain-free golf swing.